Brooklyn Unified says it's cutting a popular reading clinic for special ed students because the district doesn't have the money needed to keep the program running. But parents say the clinic is crucial to their kids' success. KPX 5's Dolan live in West Oakland where school officials have been holding a community meeting. Doc? Veronica, the district says it all comes down to money and efficiency. They believe this program is costing way too much money. So right now they're having a meeting to hear the parents out. A lot of parents are upset. They say this is another attack on special ed students. The district says the math just doesn't add up. The reading clinic serves 56 students this school year at a cost of more than a million dollars. They say 20% of that is from transporting the students from their schools to the clinic. It's invaluable. I mean, you cannot get rid of it. Parent Susie Vogler says her son, who has learning disabilities, can now read at his grade level, all thanks to the clinic. Instructors plan special reading lessons for the kids and provide around the clock attention. The program has been successful for so long is that it's small, high intensity. Uh, you know, we work two on one with the students. The district says they want to close the clinic and provide the same kind of service at the schools directly. They believe it would help more students and save money since the district is facing a multi million dollar budget deficit. Nickel and diming successful programs is not the way to be solvent. Cutting your nose off to spite your face, um, that in the long run, it may end up costing you money. OUSD has been slowly removing special ed classes in the district to adopt the inclusion model, basically putting special ed students in regular classes. A lot of parents say on paper that's a great idea, but they believe the, impl uh, the implementation has been done poorly, and they believe removing this program will further hurt their students. Live in Oakland, I'm Da Len, KPIX 5.